Hey everyone, welcome back to uh, Freedom City 1165 in Surviving Mars Below and Beyond. Creek. Right. Uh, okay, so where are we? Uh, we have a cold wave that is less than the sol from being done. We're at 44.78% temperature, which means cold waves will be done just in general. Uh, in a while. 60% atmosphere, uh, growing very slowly, but that's fine. Uh, it can grow as slowly as it wants to uh, at the moment. But what I think I probably should do... Uh, yeah, I think what I, I probably should do is chuck up another one of these guys. Uh, so I'm going to go ahead and do that. That's over here under terraforming. And that's going to be a carbonate processor. Uh, and I could just whack it in right about here. Yeah, I could. So I will. Now this takes 200 concrete. We have 700. 37 metal. We have 1.9k. 50 machine parts. We have 324. Yeah, so that's uh, definitely, there's plenty of resources to do that. So uh, let's get uh, time ticking here. And we'll just uh, observe the uh, flurry of activity here as it uh, does something maybe useful. Uh, yeah, as the uh, scurry of drones brings uh, everything in there. Yeah, that's, that's going to be the new uh, collective uh, noun for, for drones, right? A scurry of drones. Uh, food is... Uh, okay. Well, that's going to drop right away. Yeah, one of them's going to drop right away. Yeah, and then several of them will uh, will drop. Oh, that one's going to drop right away, too. Okay, food's not going to be an issue. Uh, yeah, I'm a little bit paranoid about that on account of I uh, kind of messed that up the other episode there, right? So, right. Uh, and this is uh, going up already. Uh, so that's the magic of having lots of resources, right? Uh, things get done pretty quick. Now... Uh, that's going to uh, just uh, use 150 power and use up waste rock, which we have plenty of, and it's going to uh, it's going to do a thing, right? Um, I had a trade pad somewhere, didn't I? Where did I? Did I have a trade pad or did I undo it? Landing pad, landing pad, landing pad. Uh huh. No, I I uh, sort of did that. Okay, research complete. Localized terraforming. So geoscape dome. Uh, that is uh, uh, expensive to build. Uh, right. Well, so we have that. Let's just uh, jump into here. Uh, we're doing behavioral melding, which uh, gives uh, sanatorium upgrades. Then we have to... GHG factory etc uh, amplification and then we have Martian born ingenuity core water okay right uh, what's this one uh, that's 60k uh, research we don't need to do uh, okay so that row is basically core heat convector yeah, we're not going to do that. Uh, this one. 
Uh, that's a recon center upgrade. We don't need a recon center upgrade. Uh, space mirror. Uh, magnetic shields. Why don't we research uh, mega satellites? Yeah. Oh, okay. We're already outsourcing to the max, right? So we got almost 4K research per soul. That's uh, that's somewhat impressive. Okay, close. Well, uh, what I figure is probably worth doing uh, is let's. Uh, What's this? Uh, what's the... We have homeless. Um, we have... Is it, is it just an overcrowded dome? Uh, yeah, I think it's just overcrowded. Uh, so we have 110 people in there. Yeah. Is it homelessness we have? Oh, it's homelessness. Ah, which dome is that? Okay, which dome is that? That one. Oh. Uh, I might want to do something about homelessness then. Well, can we upgrade the... Okay. Well, why don't I go ahead, just for giggles... Uh, can't build the arcology yet. Okay. So, I need somewhere for people to be living. Yeah. Uh, that does seem somewhat uh, a useful thing to do. Um, right. Well, I can't put anybody in there. Uh, right. Uh, what's this? That's a medium-sized dome. Uh, wait, what domes can I build? Uh, I can build a mega dome. A mega dome seems like fun. Yeah, you can build a mega dome. Uh, I'm gonna need to flatten some ground first. Yeah, I'm gonna need to do a little bit of that. Uh, flatten. Okay, so we'll start from here. Yeah. <clears throat> oh, we've got a waste dump there. Uh, right. Okay. We'll get that back. Flatten. Okay. Now we'll start from here. Come across to here. Yeah. Uh, we'll make a bigger uh, chunk here. Okay. Blocking objects. Okay, so if we do this thing, uh, like this, we don't have all that much excess waste rock in this. Too large. Okay. Bam. Okay, that's going to want to get rid of a little bit of waste rock. Um, yeah, okay. Uh, so we'll do that. And then I'll... Right, clearing the site is almost done. Right. Right. Well, we're clearing the waste rock out relatively quickly. And oh wow, look at that. <laughs> that was 
That was hilarious, the way that just uh, morphed like that. Uh, right, now we can go in here and grab a dome. Uh, mega dome. We can stick a mega dome here. New trade offer. Okay. Yeah. Okay, so I do have a, a trade pad that I can't f remember where I put it. Um, okay. So if I put this here. Yeah, I'm going to put that there. Now. No, we're going to reject that. Oh, it's there. Okay. Convert to landing pad. Yeah, there we go. Uh, right. Okay, so this. Uh, and then I'm going to also need the usual accoutrement. Uh, like uh, a drone hub. Or maybe two. Yeah. And a storage operation. Let's put a universal depot over here. Uh, put one here. And one here. Right? And we can... We can let us store everything. Yeah. And then we need uh, life support. So that's going to be pipes, uh, which we can get uneven terrain. We can get a pipe, and we can get power. That's going to be a power cable. Uh, come to here. Um, okay. What? What? Okay, I can't see anything on there. Uh, okay, so the pipe is uh, built. Right. And that guy is building. Yeah. No. Uh, okay. Yeah. Um, okay. So, power cable. Uh, can I get it in that way? Yeah, I can. Okay. Uh, okay. Now I need to go over here. And take that out. Take that out. Take that out. Take that out. Yeah. Okay. Uh, yeah, we have split power grids because... Uh, okay, this is going to take a minute to build. Uh, okay. Right. Well, that will, that will construct. Uh, that will be fine. Uh, oh. Exotic minerals, rare mineral, minerals, water, and sometimes polymers. Uh, let's do a detailed scan of that one, and then we'll go in here. Um, this one. Uh, that one might be worth... Uh, Um, B 
BN10 uh, might be worth, uh, that one might be worth going to. Um, Uh, that's a B type. Uh, polymers is not an issue. You know, abandon that one. Yeah. And this one, 286 of those. Uh, yeah. This one, though. Yeah. If I visit that one. Uh, prepare. Uh, okay, so we want drones, we want some of this stuff, we want 65 of this. Metals, yeah. Concrete, yeah, we'll take a few of those. Machine parts, we'll take a few more of those. Prefabs, we'll want A few of those, a micro G auto extractor. We'll take half a dozen of those. Yeah. Okay. Back. Uh, I think that's. Uh, I think that's pretty much what we want. Yeah. Oh, prefab buildings. I wanted a power accumulator. Right. Yeah, okay. Take a few power accumulators. That's probably smart. Now, uh, back. Um, take half a dozen drones. Yeah. Okay. So we request this, right? Request. Okay. Now, what's this guy? Oh. Uh, uh, why am I going to do that? Uh, so that, uh, so that I can go ahead and... Uh, because we have uh, capturing asteroids. Uh, by sending the rocket up there, uh, I, can, I can go ahead and uh, have a permanent uh, asteroid uh, base there to mine. Uh, and that, uh, that does seem like it's probably potentially useful. Uh, so I'm going to do that. And that was a, a fairly substantial... Um, uh, operation there with the okay landing okay oh this is a nice uh, layout for it okay so uh, if I drop the rocket here everything's in range yeah yeah everything's in range okay so if I were to drop the the rocket here Uh, just like this. Yeah, everything's in range of the landing site. Uh, we found the remains of a satellite on the surface of the asteroid. It seems to have collided, etc. Uh, Okay, there are still some Martian surface scans stored. Uh, try to extract those. Okay, well, I guess we we should do that. Uh, and land. Okay, land. There we go. Uh, good, we have landed. And now... The asteroid is not going to leave. Okay, good. Now, 
the first thing I want to do is uh, whoops, go in here and get uh, this down. Uh, just grab everything. Okay. Uh, so we'll do that, and the other thing I want to do is get a, a auto extractor going on that, and on that and on this one okay and then I need power I'm going to need a few of those one two three Okay, and batteries. One, two, three. Okay, and that comes almost in uh, into uh, into line there. Oh, uh. We have the Megadome and Sponsor Goals. Good. Uh, and I guess I can just uh, uh, stick a power cable there. Yeah. Uh, and that should get extraction operating. Uh, yeah. Uh, once the sun comes up. Anyway, and we have behavioral melding researched. Right, okay. Oh, I need another uh, power cable down here. Okay. Well, now that should... That should be having those guys... Uh, yeah, extracting those... Uh, yeah. Yeah. Okay, so that's, and that's going down, and that's going down, yep. And I'm going to put a depot, uh, exotic minerals depot, right there. So there's plenty of space for all of that stuff to operate. Uh, now, I can just uh, go back to Mars and basically ignore that for a while. Uh, what I, I need to do now is uh, uh, add in some uh, dome services. Uh, so, that's going to be... Uh, I'm going to want... I want at least an infirmary or two. Yeah, and I'm going to want uh, a diner or two. And I'm going to want a grocer or two, and I'm going to want, what else, uh, yeah, that should be fine, uh, you know, just to soak up some, uh, uh, uh colonists for jobs, I'll build a few of those, and 
I think that's pretty much everything I need there. What's this do? Oh. Why don't I uh, put an amphitheater in as well? Maybe a couple of them. Yeah. Okay. Now. Uh, homes. Uh, what, what do we have here that would be uh, terribly useful? Uh... Uh, okay. Well, I could build a few of uh, these. Yeah, let's build that one. Okay. And another uh, set of those... Okay, whoops. Uh, also, I think I should probably just come in here and grab a food depot, uh, put it down over here, and put one down over here too, and we'll just go, let's put 120 in there. Now let's just, yeah, let, let's keep it at 120, because it's a nice arbitrary number, right? 120. There we go. Uh, okay. Well, all of this stuff. Uh, oh, uh, I think right here. Uh, let's not have fuel in those. Yeah. Okay. And then I think it might be a good idea. Go in here and... Where's the shuttle hub? Uh... Uh, there it is. Might be a good idea to uh, stick stick another one of uh, these guys in. Yeah, with a fuel depot, right? Fuel. Yeah. There, and we'll just keep some there. Okay. A few more shuttles seem like they'd be a good idea, so uh, I'm doing a few more shuttles. I mean, we don't have dust storms or anything, so that's so there's that at least. Uh, and we are short on O2, so let's build a Moxie or two. Uh, and some water. Uh, Moxie, there we go. Build a couple of uh, uh, moxies over here. We could build a stack of them just because, you know. Uh, and we'll have plenty of O2. There we go. We have plenty of O2. Now we also need to collect some water from somewhere. So I'm going to uh, moisture vaporator. Uh, gonna uh, put up a bunch of them. Okay. So we could start with start with one here. And then Um, yep, that is there, vaporator nearby, okay, so I got that lined up, put one there, uh, now, uh, if I grab a pipes and do this, uh, yeah, I could do that. Okay, so I'll just put a pipes in there. 
Uh, right. So, uh, upgrade. Now, obviously I'm going to need a power line to run along there as well. Uh, so we'll just run a power line along there. And grab another... Uh, another few of these. One there. Okay. Uh, I think it needs to be there. Uh, vaporator nearby. Cold terrain. Yeah. So, okay. So it would go here. I think. Yeah. Okay. So put a few of those in in a line there. And that will get us a few more bits of uh, water. And that will be uh, terribly exciting. Okay. Let that one finish. Build the upgrade. Yeah, okay. Now, uh, this dome, I can go and... No. Here, you can uh, run... All the time, 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 all the time. Uh, okay, you can, you're running all the time. Yeah. Renegades in the dome, six. Um,. Right, okay, and then I need to, uh, I need to go into filters, uh, flaws, uh, idiot, no, and renegade, no, apply, okay, back, uh, now, um, we should have, the renegades leave. Uh, okay. But now we have a big stack of uh, uh, living spaces that is not overloaded. Uh, that does seem like it's a potential benefit. Right. Now let's go check in over here on our uh, asteroid where we have 51 of these. Uh, so this one, yeah. So we'll just let it uh, keep on uh, keep on uh, harvesting things, right? Um, yeah. Can you build landing pads up here? No. <laughs> uh, no. You can build drone hubs though. Uh, yeah. But I figure what I'll do is I'll just leave these extractors up, right? After the... Uh, I've got uh, more of these that I can stick up. Uh, put that there. Put that there. Put that there. Now, is this going to be extracting... Uh, this is... Ex oh, that's extracting rare metals. That's not what I want it to be doing. Uh, do that. Uh, okay. Now, go in here. I want it to be extracting requires a deposit. Um, okay, so if I put it there, yeah, if I put it there, that will uh, that will work better. 
do this. Uh, this is... Yeah, that's doing those. Uh, okay, now go ahead and put this one closer. Yeah, okay. So by having all of those up, I up already, I will have uh, plenty of... Uh, okay, uh, what we can do is we can upgrade with the improved photovoltaics. Um, having all of those up, this will be a perpetual source of exotic minerals. Okay, this is the underground. We had some cave-ins. Oh, ancient artifact interface connected. Uh, we've connected the artifact interface, um, giving us uh, processing power, etc. Drones have spontaneously started carrying extra resources all across our colony, including its furthest reaches, and have become seemingly unstoppable. It looks like this is as far as we can go with the ancient artifact, controlling about 80 to 90% of its capabilities. Uh, all drones become indestructible, no longer need recharging, and can carry one additional resource with great power. Uh, okay, now we're going to go and uh, deal with the cave-ins. Um, yeah, and then we have a little bit more. Right. Right. Uh, okay, that, that, that. Okay. Well, uh, that's, uh, that's done. Okay. Uh, so what's the... No, I want to check in up here on the surface. Uh, right. Starving colonists. Oh, that, they're over there. Okay. Uh, right. And in here, we ha we can support 216 colonists there. Wow. Uh, so they're all in there. Uh, yeah, okay. Uh, okay, I think what I should probably do is just for giggles, because I have the uh, resources, um, Martian University, should probably drop one of those in there, yeah, and uh, what else can I drop in there, Toxic Rain, uh, Right. Uh, right. Uh, Hawking Institute. I could build uh, a couple of these. Yeah. Uh, yeah, that's kind of what I was uh, going for. Uh, yeah, we'll do that. Okay. What's this? Right, tourists. Uh, we don't have tourists, so that's uh, that's fine. Uh, okay, you uh, operate all shifts. Yeah. Okay. Uh, what's this? Let's do a detailed scan of that one, and then we'll go go and uh, uh, take a look at, yeah, Thousand Water, uh, okay, that is a treasure trove, don't need it though, abandon. No, I might, 
You know what? I'm going to visit that one. Uh, we have the uh, resources to do it, right? So, uh, so if I just put some fuel on here, actually just clear it and put the fuel on. Yeah, and uh, take take a few drones, but nothing else. I'm not going to take anything else. I'm just sending this up here to uh, to uh, grab the, uh, the the capture it right request. You, uh, yeah, okay, uh, right. So I'm just sending that rocket up there to capture the asteroid and see what's doing up there, right? Uh, that one's uh, unusual, so it might have an anomaly or something up there too. So it might be worth uh, worth exploring. Uh, that's uh, the whole reason for uh, for uh, uh, capturing it, right? Uh, so after I do that, I'm going to put the cut in, and then we'll be good for the uh, uh, for this episode. So we'll go up here, and yeah, there's an anomaly. Yeah, I thought there would be, and it's a two-parter, so uh, the only way we're going to exploit everything, uh, yeah, okay, so you, uh, you can land there, so I'll let it land, um, yeah, that's an event anomaly, so uh, hard to say what the scenario is there, but I will uh, grab the usual uh, depot uh, and uh, collect everything, and yeah, and we'll drop back to the Martian surface uh, where I will uh, put the cut. And uh, next, uh, next episode, we'll do something with that asteroid, I guess. And we might get to uh, uh, ending cold waves, 50% uh, temperature uh, in uh, the near future. Right. Well, uh, I, I'll just mention on the way out, if you want to support the channel for some bizarre reason, uh, I do have a Patreon. Uh, the link to that uh, should be in the description if you're interested. If not, that's fine too. And I guess see you back next time.